Hello and welcome to HD Calcs. I'm Rick and in this video we're going to have a look at how we can use Pi on the Casio FX 115 ES Plus calculator. To do that we'll use the shift key that looks like this located here, the times 10 to the x key with the shift function of Pi that looks like this located here, and the S to D key or conversion key that looks like this located here. If we just want to get the value of pi on our screen, we can press shift and then the times 10 to the x key. We see we get the symbol for pi on our screen. And if we press equals, that goes down to our answer line. If we want to get that as a decimal, we can press the s to d key and see we get a result of 3.14159, etc. Pi is useful in a lot of different calculations. For example, if we want to calculate the circumference of a circle with the radius of 11 centimeters, we can use pi and do this formula here, 2 pi times r. So we start by entering our 2 and then shift times 10 to the x to get our pi. And then we multiply that by our radius of 11, so times 11 and press equals, and we see this gives us a result of 22 pi, which if we want to convert that to a decimal, we can press the S to D key, and see we get a circumference of 69.1150, etc. We can also use this to calculate the area of a circle with this formula here, pi times r squared. So if we want to find the area of a circle with a radius of 12 centimeters, what we do is start by entering pi, so shift times 10 to the x to get our pi there, times our radius, which was 12, and then we square that and press equals, and we see we get a result of 144 pi, which if we want that as a decimal, we can press the S to D key. and get a result of 452.3893, etc. All right, I hope this helps, and good luck on those tests out there, everybody.